Uh, hi guys, uh, so I just received uh, something I bought from a worker. So I saw this. Uh, so I guess uh, we know that uh, this actually resemble quite a bit from uh, I think Devil Z at the design. But I'm curious of how this thing actually works. Yeah, so I bought it. Not really that I need it, <laughs> but I'm just very curious how it works. Yeah, especially when we know that when we look at this thing, right? Okay, it, it doesn't look like it's gonna flex. Uh, yeah, so of course they have an adapter for the um, telemac. Uh, also, I received the uh, uh, the uh, that. So I actually bought uh, I think a hundred of those uh, to try it out. So I just received them anyway. So I'm very curious uh, how it works and uh, to basically confirm my suspicion for how this thing works. So maybe let's just uh, install this and uh, take a look and let's see whether it is what I expect it to be. So it's supposed to be able to uh, handle full length darts as well as uh, uh, short darts, right? Okay, so let's take a look. Installation should be simple. Anyway, this is my testing strife. Uh, yeah, so let's take a look. I'm just gonna screw it in. Uh, looking at the picture when I first saw it, I feel that no, it must be a, it's probably something that it's not gonna flex. And uh, it's probably gonna take advantage of some clearance uh, tol tolerance of uh, the cage and whatnot all right so we have installed this let's put it more towards the center okay so so okay uh, this drive i think i i don't have the uh, uh, lock removed so it's still uh, basically still having all the locks man i should have removed all the locks yeah Anyway, this is my testing drive. All right, let's, so let's take a look at uh, the full length dust. Uh, okay, let me choose a color. Okay, I'll just choose this one. Okay, see whether does it really fire off full length. Okay, so okay, so we will put it in. Okay. So, yeah, it should fire the full length. It's still you have to push it in, but I'm not too sure whether you notice this. Now, when I push it in, okay, you realize by the time I reach the uh, sort of the pusher, now the mag is not fully uh, inserted, All right? So if I continue to push up, so you actually press the uh, darts down. So in other words. Uh, this does not flex but uh, basically just push the uh, dart uh, sort of down so it's actually not the uh, so-called the, the uh, center line to the entrance so but it's enough in terms of clearance if i push it in it's slightly below the entrance but because of the uh, the clearance you will tilt up and you will still enter the flywheel can you see it's at an angle so that's uh that's exactly what I thought it, 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 it would come out to be. So this is this probably confirmed my uh, suspicion. And then of course the uh, the uh, short short length dart. I'm pretty sure this will probably be the center line. Uh, by the way, this adapter is uh, all the way forward. And uh, it's actually quite, quite sort of tight. So it's not going to drop down anytime. I mean, the magazine drop kind of uh, effect. It's not going to do that. But uh, the good thing is, of course, it is, uh, it's not going to move left and right. Okay, so again, if I were to insert this in, I'm pretty sure that uh, it will just... Uh, be center line the dart is not going to be pushed down or anything and then of course you will be able to you know, enter easily into the to the to the entrance yeah yep i guess uh this is how it works uh, so if you were to see it again 
comparing to the to the full length that maybe I choose a different color it is going to be more obvious okay this one right so if we go in and if you push it up you see it's already reached the uh, pusher so now they are just pushing it down yeah you can see okay. all right and then of course if i push you just enter and tilt up and uh, then enter the uh, flywheel itself yep so i guess that's how it works uh yep so maybe later on I'll see whether it fires well or not okay so uh i put in a few types of darts the uh, main gun the waffle darts the uh, q fake and also the latest uh worker uh full length worker head darts so let's see whether it fires the full length dart it might be loud so take note Seems to work fine. Let's try the uh, shot dart. Yep, uh, it seems to work fine as well. So I guess uh, uh, this uh, video shows you uh, basically how this uh, pusher works. Yep, so it does not really flex. Uh, you just take advantage of the uh, tolerance of the uh, the entry point to the uh, firewheel cage. So if you have a cage that uh, you know, the tolerance is not that uh, wide, then uh, you might face some issue, I don't know. I'm using the worker uh, canted cage. But I must say, uh, this is a, a older older purchase. When I purchased the newer one, you look at the color, it's actually quite different. And I also also observe, you know, some of the uh, entry points are uh, slightly uh, machined differently. Yeah, and I also notice even the uh, orange color wheel, sometimes it's like uh, brighter, uh, sometimes it's like coming matte. So I'm not too sure how the, uh, how, how worker does their quality assurance or what whatnot I, I don't know maybe they have changed their so, so called the, uh, the contractor that does all this uh, CNC for them I don't know but I do hope that uh, they can uh, produce something uh, with a higher cons consistency but uh, it still works yeah but anyway anyway so the <laughs> back to the video video the video is about the pusher itself so uh, you can see how it works and uh, yeah so I'm Tungsten thanks for watching